Hi, I am Suzanne, and I'm here for a little bit. And welcome to to the little time I have. I am on air from Minnesota. Hello, Minnesota. And I am a clairvoyant and a light trance medium. And I'm hoping to get a good caller tonight. Um, I hope that everyone is okay after the super full moon. It was beautiful, known as the buck moon. And it was in Capricorn, which is a very responsible um, and a very mature sign. It's known as the teacher. And that's what it does in our charts, our personal charts. It teaches us. And um, yeah, so so that's what happened a couple days ago. I hadn't been on air, but um, I hope that everyone is letting go of the things that don't that don't suit suit you anymore or benefit you anymore. I hope that everyone is learning how to balance what they need in their life. I do as well. I need some balance right now. Um, Bobby from Missouri. Yeah. Hello. How are you tonight? Hello. I'm okay. How are you? Good, good. You're my neighbor. I'm glad. I'm in Minnesota oh. <laughs> tonight. Oh. So, so what can I help with tonight? Um, um are my finances going to get any better soon? I didn't hear the, the first part of that. Oh, I'm sorry. Are my finances going to get any better soon? Okay. Let's see. Let's see what Spirit says. I'm looking for what Spirit has to say or show me. I feel like, I feel like it's going to take a little bit of time. Um, I feel like, I feel like change. There's a lot of change for you. Um, I don't know how this is resonating, but I feel like there's changes in your finance. And I feel like there was a, there was a change a little while ago, maybe anywhere from three months to a month ago, there was a change. Yeah. And I feel like it needs to settle and found and make a foundation. But I feel like it will be a while longer. And um, okay. I'm, think, I'm looking. I feel as if it has a lot to do with the Pluto transiting Aquarius, and that was in March. And I feel like there are lessons in this, even though you, it, it feels very scary and, and unsecure, there's a lesson in this. So I would suggest that every day, if you can get a chance, just to tell the universe, guide me with whatever I need to know. Um, because this is, this is some sort of good lesson for you. And I'm not saying to hurt you, um, but yeah. there, it, it seems to be working in a way as to teach you something that benefits you. Um, So, so I feel some of that has to do with letting go, with letting go worry or, or refining a way to look at money or finances. Um, and to know, I don't know. I think the message too is the world does have enough to take care of you. Does that resonate? Because I feel that there's a fear. There's been a lot of change, that's, that's for sure. <laughs> I feel change. like there's, 
I feel like there's a fear that the world has not got enough to to take care of you. And spirit is saying yeah. yes. Spirit, spirit is letting me know that the, the world does have what it takes to take care of you. And and if you can find just, you know, in your daily life to to kind of look at what you're learning, because I feel like a very important lesson in faith is what's going on. Can you feel that? Like you, you're strengthening into faith. Even when, when oh, you I... are kind of even when you're in fear, you have to put so, put it in to the hands of the, the creator in the universe and, and say, I don't know what else to do except to be patient and have faith. Yeah, that's pretty much what I, I am doing, being it in his um, hands. And... I feel like within a month, things should look, look very well for you. Um, I also feel like something as new, again, is opening up for you that is connected to what just changed. And it will make you more comfortable and more secure, and it will be ongoing. Um, I feel like like uh, you got like a month, and I feel like uh, I keep getting the initials of W. I don't know why, but W. Um, so I would I would I would say yes. And I feel like things will get better and, and be more secure as time goes on. So I would say you only have about a month to to, to really uh, keep the faith and keep your chin up and, and know that things are going to work out for your betterment. Does that well, make sense? Does that resonate? <laughs> yes. It, yes, it, it can be hard. <laughs> it can be really hard. Yes. Um, to have that, but but I think that this is a, a small part of what's going on. Um, so yes, Ken, do you have any other quick questions for me? I've got a few more minutes. Um, do you see um, me being back with my children? Let me see. I do certainly feel the distance. Do you have three? I keep seeing three people. Yeah, I do. Okay. They kind of faded. They faded away, like too busy or um, not really, not really even grounded. Yeah. It's not in touch. I feel yeah, I feel like uh, life life is just taking them by the by the tail and just grabbed them and and they don't even have time for themselves. But I feel like don't lose hope on that either, because I do feel love coming from them, and I feel like every once in a while you should shoot them an email or a phone message and just let them know that you still love them. Um, but I just feel like. Uh, a lot of bus busyness. And sometimes yeah. you have to remember your mother. <laughs> <laughs> Mothers yeah. are important. We are life givers. Sure. So I do believe that that will happen. I just feel like they need to be reminded all the time that, that, that there's someone who loves them and is waiting for a call or a visit. Okay? Okay. Sounds cool. All right. Well, thank you so much for allowing me to share tonight. I really hope that oh you God. have a great week. And I hope that this month goes really quick for you. I hope that you, you I, feel secure and comforted. I thank you so much. I feel All better right. now already. I, <laughs> thank oh, you so yeah. very Just, much. What was your name again? My name is Suzanne. Suzanne. And thank okay. you so much. Okay, thank you. Have you. a, good have a night. wonderful day. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Well, everyone, thank you so much for spending another time for me, uh, with me. And I hope that everyone has a wonderful week. And you can catch me at psychicpass.com. And I will be back here next week.
バイバイ。